live at Wonder Festival 2018 just before the show opens and we're with Shanab, CEO of Figurama Collectors. Shanab, thanks for joining me today. You're with your first piece. This is Ragnarok 4. Can you tell us a little bit about why you chose this as your first statue to enter into the market? Sure. Thank you so much, Chris. It's a pleasure to have you here and uh, I'm so glad to have you. Thank you. Um, actually, we like wanted to uh, begin with something that it's um, like let's say it's it's like more of a test that uh, uh, that we want to like uh, test our uh, limits, our you know like uh, boundaries, uh, how we can push them. So uh, in Ragnarok, uh, it's uh, we like really believe that this character it get lots of attention. It's non-commercial. We don't like to go for the Mona Lisa. We like to go for a, maybe a prettier paintings, but it's unknown somehow, or, or, or like let's say it's like least focused. So we love to bring it up, just like ourselves. We are new, but we believe that we have a big capabilities and so for uh, It's created by the master Walter Simonson. Uh, we really like believe in the stuff that he does. Uh, the team of IDW Publishing, they are uh, so uh, creative, so friendly. Uh, they would like come to, uh, you know, uh, accept our offer even if we are just a new company and we have never created anything before. So yeah, they uh, gave us a trust and I, I believe that we give it back to them. Also. Excellent. Yeah, so I had a chance to unbox this piece yesterday and it went together real smooth. So tell us about you know, your philosophy there. Everything's colorful yeah. and make it easy yeah. for people to put together. Uh, yeah, actually uh, it was a close collaboration with the creative artist uh, Gerald Singh and it's uh, been uh, done by uh, Riyad. Riyad is the 3D artist, he's a young 3D artist that it also pushed his uh, boundaries and honestly he like a amazing piece over here. So um, us and the concept artist, we, we like did our best to create a scene to like uh, freeze that moment in Ragnarok Thor a comic and let's say summarize the whole story in this drama. And uh, as you can see, you know, it like captures many elements as, as you go 360, it, it, it like gets uh, the uh, time machine and you know like another easter eggs here and there and we always like make sure to put an easter egg in like most of our statues. Yeah, and you can see the Taurus trail. It's, a, it's an awesome piece, it's so dynamic. You got tons of action here, the zombies falling over the place. I love how the lightning is like slashing across the rib cage and you got the battle yeah, damage happening. Yeah. And that was one of the most uh, challenging uh, pieces to do here that uh, we we had to make sure that the trail it, like passes uh, through the same line and like cut the jaw of the left yep. dropper and then goes to the under the armpit of the middle dropper. Lots of support here, you got it supported in three points. Yeah. There's no chance of that thing moving over no, time. No. Looks great. So tell us a little bit about Figurama, the company, how you guys started, you kind of new on the scene. Yeah. You know, we're at, we're at Wonder Festival, it's a huge event, there's tons of stuff here. Yeah. So why did you guys want to get into this yeah. marketplace? Yeah, uh, that's a good question. Actually, this is uh, our second uh, participation. Yep. We participated in the Summer Wonder Festival last year. And honestly, that was a huge success for Figurama, as uh, we wanted to leave a uh, footprint into the market. Uh, we want to make an impact and uh, more than impact to like make hopefully like to make a, a change that will inspire others to, to uh, go out of the museum post world and to go like more into uh, dynamic uh, statues uh, because i think the collectors they are a niche market and they deserve more uh, this uh, stuff i like believe it's like more of an art than just to have yeah yeah Awesome. You guys are doing some great things. I like what you're doing. You're keeping the edition sizes low. Yeah. The prices always come in. Yeah. Really good price points. So I like what Figurama's doing. Shanab, thanks, thanks for the interview. Thanks, Chris. And okay. hopefully we'll like, see you soon. Yeah, we will. Thanks. Okay. More videos to come, guys. Thank you. Thank you.